Hello and welcome back. In this uh, second lecture of this series, here we will uh, learn how to load parameters from a file. We'll also create 1D geometry and then we will uh, load the definition and declare variables. So this would be uh, this would be uh, slightly advanced. So do not worry. I will go step by step, and you can follow along if you want to to reproduce the same result in your own computer. Also note that I will share these files with you. So if you want to try it out from your own, you can do that. Uh, the file may not be directly available in uh, Udemy website. So uh, you might have to mail me uh, once to get these files because uh, there might be some legal issues. I can't open distribute these files over the web. So you have to personally mail me to get these files. Okay, enough of talking. The first thing what we will do is we'll go to the model builder window under global definition and we'll go to parameters right inside parameters uh, what we'll do is we'll load from file but before that uh, let me show you what are the files we are going to load so we have two files one for parameter and the other for variable which we will declare inside the definition so if i open the parameter file you can see that there are a lot of text okay uh, it might look a bit confusing but i will show you what will happen so i will click on load from file and then i'll go to desktop uh, i have the files here and i'll select lithium ion battery 1d parameter and click open when i open I'll just drag this. Uh, let me rearrange a bit. Okay, this is nice. Okay, this is cool. So, if I place the notepad file side by side, you can see that the first column represents the name. The second, that is the number after the space. You see there's a space. In between those are the expression that is the values and that values is rendered and is represented in this column and the description is the last string okay so name expression description name expression description this is how you have to write your parameter so uh, if you are doing some other kind of simulation and Suppose uh, say you read some journal and article where they have done some kind of simulation and you are trying to note down the parameters. So you have to write the name, give a space, write the values, write the units in third presses, okay, and then the description and save it as a txt file. So this is how you write uh, parameters in console. Okay, let me close this document. This is not useful. Okay, so I have loaded this document. now my parameters are loaded in console that is i can use all these values anywhere inside my simulation without any problem i don't have to define anything anywhere so that's it uh, in our next video we'll learn how to um, make the 1d geometry and uh, go along so thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video.